Oh, good day, folks. It's Patrick here, sitting out here in this uh, park. And I've just got myself some fish and chips, folks. Have a look at this. See that? Fish and chips, folks, right there. Well, the reason why I've got some fish and chips, apart from the fact that I love fish and chips, is that um, I made this stuff called uh, chip shop curry sauce. Now, apparently, over in uh, Great Britain and other places, they slather on this chip shop curry sauce onto fish and chips, so I thought I'd give it a go. our fish and I believe that that's flake. Absolutely delicious, crispy, hot. Ooh, we got, uh, oh, look at that. Look at that crispy end bit there. I'm gonna enjoy that. Chips. Oh, look at that, eh? And a good old dim sim. And you can't go past the classic potato cake, folks. So I'm gonna get stuck into this. And in the meantime, Let's see how I make this curry sauce. Okay, now, here we're gonna start by chopping up a good old onion, folks. Uh, it's one of the most enjoyable things I ever do is chop up onions. I just love getting those tears in my eye. It's absolutely fantastic. And then we're gonna blend them up. I thought I'd give them a bit of an extra pulverizing, folks, because I don't want big lumps in this chip shop curry sauce. And anyway, this is a truckload of butter here that I'm melting down. All the details, all the recipe and all that will be in the description down below if you want to make it for yourself, folks. And that remains to be seen whether you're, whether I'll say that you should because this could be this could be uh, complete crap. But anyway, let's just see how it turns out. We've got the butter in there. We've got the flour in there. We've got the milk in there. Uh, I hope I remember, yes, I do remember the good old curry powder's got to be in there. Curry powder of your choice, folks. It really doesn't matter. A bit of salt, of course, never goes astray. Me being a salt addict, a salt freak, call me what you will. Then uh, I'm just going to give this whole thing a bit of a blend. I don't know that I really had to, but I'm doing it anyway. There you go, folks. Chip shop curry sauce. Oh, no, there's my fish and chips, folks. I've got my good old flask here. Up and pour out some of this curry sauce, eh? What are you doing here? What do you want? Oh, there you go. Looks and smells delicious. Mmm, very nice curry taste. Righto, folks, first I'm going to try, I'm dying to try a bit of this fish. So I'm going to grab this crunchy end bit here. Mm. Oh, very nice. It's definitely flake. My favourite fish, folks. Mmm. A little bit under seasoned. That's why I brought my chicken salt, folks. Hey, got to get some chicken salt on there. Sprinkle that on there. In fact, I'll sprinkle that on everything. Now, first thing I have to do, try one of these chips. Whoops. Mm. This joint made it right in front of me, folks. Caulfield Fish and Chips, the joint's called. Never been there before. Mmm. Also got some tartar sauce and some lemon. What I think I need to do, though, is try some of these chips with the good old curry sauce, eh? Try just one at the moment and see how it goes. 
See that? Yum ho. Oh yeah. That is delicious. Oh. I could drink this stuff. I can see why it's so popular. The Brits love this stuff. The combination of the slight curriness. It's got a sweetness there. I actually added a bit more sugar to it off camera. I'm just gonna give this bird here another chip because it's not going away. Righto, mate, righto. You want a chip? Hey? You want a chip? Oh, there you go, eh? Absolutely stunning, folks. That is a match made in heaven. I know it's hard to believe. But six squillion Brits and Scotsmen and Irishmen and whoever, and whoever else eats it, they can't be wrong, folks, and they're not wrong. This is fabulous. Another yeah, bit, bit of good old classic fried dim sim, folks. Mmm. Mmm cooked to perfection. It's a mixture of mystery meats and cabbage, folks. I wonder what that's going to be like with a bit of curry sauce. Oh, I know it's going to be good. Mmm. <laughs> I've forgotten. The potato cake. Oh. Mm. This is one of the best potato cakes I've ever had, folks. Soft and fluffy on the inside, crunchy on the outside. Mm. Oh. I gave those birds a couple of chips, folks. They seem to have buggered off. Oh, well, here comes one back. I'm going to go and finish all of this. <clears throat> I love my curry sauce, folks. Go and make some and try this. And until next time, I'll see you all later. Thanks for watching. Good old mate over there, he's got another chip. You right, mate? Don't muck around with these magpies, folks. Oh. Well, let's come back again. Another one? Come on. Ah, oh, there you are. Come on. You see it. There you go. Oh, yeah.